Um, I hope, or uh, whatever. Let me just show you some of the cards. I don't know what this card is, but I'm going to put it on top. All right. All right. Now, to see who goes first, let's roll some virtual dice. I guess you got the choice. I'll play first. Fair enough. Go down. There we go. Oh, yeah, to show off for just a quick sec. I'm running Animar, Soul of Elements, Soul of Brokenness, and he is running Skullbriar, he do, who does not stay dead. The Walking Grave. And uh, to give everyone a heads up about what we're, our homebrew, our, not our homebrew, our rules are for this, uh, everything as normal except we're also doing the uh, first partial Paris Free. We're doing that mulligan. Or, yeah. Me neither, bro. Me neither. I'm thinking. Three away, draw three more, right? Agreed. And then, yeah, the first time it's free. So I'm putting three away as well. I think. I think we're just doing three. And we don't shuffle until after we finish doing this bit. Yeah, so three down. I'll keep, and then I'll start shuffling. So we can get this back. Yours was a land issue, I guess? Uh, no, it was just cards I didn't want in my opening hand. Fair enough. One of the, the better things about Skullbriar is that he doesn't, I mean, I, I'm used to seeing him in Tiny Leaders, yeah. but even in EDH, he doesn't need the curve to be in the end. No. He just needs to come out on turn one and start beating face. Turn one, yeah, there we go. Elvish Spirit Guide, go. All right. If I had thought about that, I'd have put my Elvish Spirit Guide in. Dunk. Whatever this card is, needs to be on top. <laughs> nice. Alright, so uh, you're up. And since it's two player, we aren't going to draw for our first turn. Pass. Alright. Uh, well, okay. Whatever you put down is probably better than what I drew, I think. We're going to take two, and we're going to throw out a wild canter. Okay. Off our breeding pool, and then we'll pass the turn. Hey, buddy. Good to see you, Skull. Yeah. Come on. Come at me, bro. Let's get out our 400 dice for him. So, Animar dice is we just take all of the dice in here and drop them at once on top of them. And then whatever number that is, we multiply it by itself, by itself again. Okay, there we go. <laughs> uh, it has to hit you before it gets a counter, so you... We're, we're getting there, though. Okay. So I'm taking one for the 37, gets the counter. Okay. Yeah, not going to block with a canter. I don't think that is where I ought to be. Gotcha. Go ahead then. Okay. Because, well, I don't have to explain it to you. You can you can figure it out. It lets me pop it for red. Yeah. Blue, green, Aminar. Solo, he's about to die. Pass turn. Since it's an EDH deck and not a Tiny Leaders deck, maybe he makes it for a while. I'm not used to seeing... I guess Toxic Deluge makes sense. Demonic Tutor. Oh, okay. Demonic Tutor for that Toxic Deluge I just mentioned. 
some guy's cradle shenanigans. He didn't even know I owned a demonic tuner. It's an EDH deck and it's black. I actually just assumed it was in there. It's one of those, like, I assume Solemn Simulacrum is in like every EDH deck ever. If it's blue, I assume it's Cyclonic Rift, you know, the usual stuff like that. Why is that? What are we setting up? Are you guys setting up the game? Oh, nice. Sweet, dude. You know, this may be a bad call, but whatever it is. All right. So in the meantime, I'm going to uh, roll out all of the bad numbers on my die, on my dice. I have more than one, so it's dice. Well, uh -oh, that's an eight. I didn't say high roll, I applied high roll. Oh, that's an eight. 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 It's seven, okay. Eight, seven. Seven's average. Five. Okay. We see the trend, we see the pattern, and now that I've said that I've jinxed it, it's gonna go back up. Like that, eight. <laughs> Too many cards to go through. The funny thing is, I can't find the card I want. Seven. I'm just gonna entertain for a second. That's fine. You do your thing. Snake eyes. All right. We're gonna give you the much more appropriate. Well, black and white or white and black. Yeah, I guess actually this one has the, it's one is less readily visible, it's kind of marked a little bit. Some of the paint starts to come off. Right. At least I don't have to show you what it is. Yeah, that's right. As long as it doesn't identify itself, I can't think of it like it has to be an instant or a creature or something with identification. I can't think of cards that make you show what it is, unless there's an identifier. Of course, as soon as I say that, I, someone could put in the comments. Someone went on to Gatherer and looked and saw, wait a second, there's this card that makes you reveal it, even though it doesn't require an identifier. Alright. Now, is Vampiric Tootle, Tootle legal in this format? Tootle? No idea. Vampiric Tootle. I don't play a whole lot of EDH. Fair enough. You said, hey, let's play some EDH, and I said, why not? Ding, ding, ding. Play my land, bounce the land. Fair enough. Go ahead. Okay. Yeah, that pro black, doing some work. In before I get wrecked by what is invariably the next card he has coming out. I'm going to do a few damage to that. All right, loading, loading, still loading. That would be kind of cool. Right. Let's not play it that quickly, though. We can slow down just a teeny tiny bit. <laughs> yeah, let's play it the other way so that I have a chance if something goes wrong. <sighs> Not an easy choice. Okay. Wall of Blossoms. Okay. Give Aminar a counter. See Aminar. Draw. Hey, good to see you, buddy. Not necessarily what I wanted to see, but I'll take that. I think I'm actually just going to go a little bit more slowly. I'm going to put out a Vivid Crab. Gets two charge counters? Charge counters. Some kind of counter. And we're going to swing two at you. Just two. Okay. Poke, poke. It's commander damage, but whatever. 
<laughs> Actually, that might matter for, for you. That might matter. And then pass turn. All right. In before toxic deluge, damnation, languish, something like that comes out and bites me in the butt. Yeah, <laughs> see, this for just. Oh, it's a win. Never mind. Yeah. It's not as it enters, it's when it enters, so it's a trigger. Okay. Yep. Damnation. Damnation. Rancor, okay. Trample is a thing. Yeah. Protection from black in my ass. <laughs> See that 4 2 trample? Split the boots. Haste, text proof. Fair enough. Combat? Mm -hmm. Four. Do I want to stop this with the Wall of Blossoms? Uh, no, not really. I'll take four and go to five, Commander. I am actually going to keep that posted act. Be important. I got you. Yeah, nice. Uh, what's the two for? Two commander damage. Uh, should be five, because I'm taking all of it. No, for me. Oh, okay. But, <laughs> okay, sorry. I'm, I'm brilliant. I'm a professor. Alright, that's turn. C, senor. It's EDH, you never know. Oh, that's a draw. That's a top deck. Okay. So, to start off. Oh my god, are we gonna do this? We're gonna do this. We are going to do this. Sylvan Ranger. Mr. Ranger, sir. Goes and gets a basic out of the deck. Okay. Basic uh, forest in this case. Okay. And that's probably going to be your land play. Um, it's not actually. I'm deck thinning. Oh, gotcha. Deck thinning is good too. Mm -hmm. yeah, you're right. Point. <laughs> Hey, how's it going, man? Alright. Guy's Cradle. Okay. <coughs> Make three. Cloudstone Courier. Mm, yeah. Oh, no. Not quite. I'm just shy. Just shy. Pastor. Do you want to come back? Mm -hmm. Five. Um, block with Animar. Block three, take two. Block three, take two. Kill uh, Skullbrine. He still gets his counters. He's dead though. But he's a 4-4 four -four now. Uh, I think he still dies, actually. That's fine too. Yeah. No, he, yeah, he, he still dies. With three counters. Yeah, with three counters, that's right. 
So like the damage is dealt simultaneously, and the, it's like okay, that's that's a good way of putting it. So it's like the difference between lifelink and armadillo cloak. Yeah. Armadillo cloak is after combat damage has been dealt. Yeah. No worries. Um. It's not like you can't just cast it right back or anything. Tap target creature's power tap just becomes a one until end of turn. <laughs> Don't think, it doesn't suit you. Very appropriate. Can I sketch these down? Just so that they're easier to see for them. Yeah. Go ahead. The closer we have it to that side, the better. That's all. That's all. Okay. Now. Time for stuff to happen. We're going to start off with. Ooh, reading pool. Foul emissary. All we care about here is when it enters the battlefield, uh, look at the top four cards, reveal a creature, put it in hand, and then the others go on the bottom in any order. Okay. Ooh, are we going to do that? I don't actually need to, but we're going to, so... Ancestral statue? Okay. Yeah, you, you know how this goes, I think. And then I was just like, Valimisary. everything's costing less, and I'm like, oh yeah, Animar is broken. With a Cloudstone Curio's trigger on the stack, yeah. make four mana, return Wild Blossom to hand. And in my hand, I was waiting for it. Peregrine Drake? Okay. Uh, untap up to five lands. And as you see, we get we get infinite mana doing this. We're going to uh, Foul Emissary, Peregrine yep. Drake. We're going to switch up, after I do that once with Foul Emissary, um, we're going to switch it up with Wall of Blossoms. I'm just going to draw my deck, okay. if that's okay. Yeah. Um, if that's okay, there's a command tower in here somewhere. Um, I'm going to get out the command tower and play it. Yeah, Animor is broken is a good way of putting it. Um, where is Command Tower? <laughs> there it is. So there's Command Tower. Uh, that's my land for the turn, which means I can get... Well, it doesn't matter anyway. I have infinite mana. Um, this is my hand, so Animar is infinitely large. I'm going to cast all the creatures in my deck. Urbrass the Hidden is going to give them haste. Okay. One of those creatures is um, Crater of Behemoth. Another of those creatures is Ulamog. Gotcha. Either Ulamog, I can exile or destroy all of your permanents by doing the bounce loop. Yeah. And okay. swing for infinity. Yeah. Reflect and call. <laughs> there we go. Oh my god, Wombo combo! Okay. So, yeah, Animar is stupid. I needed one more mana to do that last turn, but. What's up, Glissom? Okay. Yeah, Animar is a lot less broken in Tiny Wars because you can't cast huge spells as readily, mm -hmm. other than Hydras with X in your cost and that sort of thing. Yeah. Although it ends up playing as kind of the same as the way I want it. Uh, I don't even want to get rid of any of these cards, but I have to, I think. Well, I guess I don't have to. I am on the draw. I should, though. I should. Yeah, we're gonna keep. I'm going to put two, draw two. Four. Right. This is the most questionable for me. I think I probably should shove it. See what else I get. But I think I'm okay, actually. Okay. 
realize you can see the bottom card, Sorry. but I can't hold it any other way. Okay, let me shuffle, like actually shuffle. Yeah. Also, that just didn't work, period, anyway. This is where the decision goes wrong. I'm like trying to put them back together and then, no. <coughs> you cannot control. You have no power here. Here we go. I have a job every single time. Yeah, you're up. Alright. Go ahead. Makes sense. Ancient Ziggurat, any color but only for creatures. Eldish Mystic, last turn. Hi, how you doing? Yeah, I do. Okay, baby break, one second. <laughs> Oh, oh, unless we want to... Oh, I guess we can't You want to introduce him to the camera? Yeah. <laughs> you want to say hi there? Say hi. Yeah, I'll, I'll lower it a I bit. Think, so. I think you may be camera shy. Oh. <laughs> That's so cute. That's so cute. Hey there. Hey there. Say I'm mad because I'm hungry. Oh. I'll let you be then. I'll let you be. <laughs> Okay. We're back. Oh, Commander. Um, yeah, I think it was, yeah, you went tapped through. Yeah. yeah. Realized I played my lands in the wrong order. And now I'm like, oh, that's sad. <laughs> so. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> See ya. Fetch. It's a tropical island. You said I can't win the best game. I've been taking the time to put together the uh, Domina deck, yeah. which doesn't have any boxes in it. But over at Galactic Quest, they let you play, granted the events aren't sanctioned, but they let you play with uh, proxies, yeah. just as a casual playthrough. But if they ever start sanctioning events, then, well, that'll change, but in the meantime... It's fine. Uh, cast Animar. Okay. Uh, red, blue, green. Yeah. And pass turn. All this is like I mean, I can swing and then you have Um here, let me kinda move it for you real fast. Alright. Pause break. One of the guys over there got a, something sticky on my controller. So I cleaned off the controller itself and then found it on the cord too, so that's not fun. Hi school briar. All right. Pass turn. Okay. How about Wall of Blossoms? I'm just going to put you down here. You're basically a mana dork. <laughs> uh, draw a card. Oops, did not get there. Relic Law Mystic? Copper Mirror? Since it's free at this point. Are these all Yeah, that's that's fine. That's available. Quite. Swing four. Okay. Pass turn. Mm. 
I didn't get a land. I got all the mana dorks, though. Makes sense. Yeah. Get those counters. Swift boots. Makes sense as well. Combat? Yep. Good jump. Gotcha. Go ahead. All right. Okay. So. Hmm. Warp? Solemn simula uh, simula simulacrum? I'm not like, entirely sure how to pronounce that. Uh, Yens, there we go. He's Yens. Sad robot. <laughs> Island. Let's see if we can get there the normal route. Uh, Merchant of Secrets. <laughs> Just another wall of blossoms. Well, another elvish visionary. That's a better way of putting it. <laughs> Imperial recruiter. Okay. Because I know I like shit on planets that were not two or less. <laughs> Decisions, decisions. Yeah, I can't get you, but I wish. I wish. Uh, where are you? Uh, Kikiji? Okay. No, you're not dead. <coughs> not yet. I got you. Yeah. Spoiler alert, I don't have a Deceiver X or a Pester Mine in my hand. Um, I hope to one day, but... <laughs> Okay. Uh, <laughs> wait a minute. Do I get highlights? Gain one life? Yeah, I guess I can't do both. And you have haste in your life. They have a lot of stuff. One series they did is a million dollars in the market. Blood. Blood. Yeah, the concept is there's a million dollars, but it never happens when you still take a million dollars. Oh, I thought it was going to have the million dollar butt. Literally, like, uh, I'll grab the. Mmm. 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 Mmm.
guess that would mean that I would you take the blood and come home. Two little yeah. Yeah. Three. Yeah. Three. Yeah. But for you, maybe not. Sucks for everyone on my right. <laughs> 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 Yeah, actually, I think I do have you this time. Um, no, no, I, I don't, do I? I don't think I do. I have no idea. I don't. Notwithstanding the craziest luck draw, I do not have you this time. Okay. <laughs> I am, however, going to make you have it this turn. Or, yeah, this turn. Return from Kiro Recruiter. Okay. Recast Imperial Recruiter. Yep. You already know. The Saber X Arc. I feel like I'm being punished for playing black green and not keeping hands with full removal. Um. Combat? Yeah. Swing nine. Okay. Pass turn, stop on upkeep. Yeah. <laughs> on your upkeep, we're going to Deceiver Exarch, tap down Skullbriar. Okay. And now you may go. Hmm. Did you put the Kiki back in your hand? Uh, yes, Kiki's in my hand. With Imperial Recruiter. Yeah. I haven't actually cast the Kiki yet. Originally it was just for value, but Mana War and Kill Recruiter, I couldn't resist. Mm -hmm. I needed one more land. Like a five mana wrath or something? Six mana. Oh. I have five mana. Oh, because Golgari, yeah, rock. Yeah. But I didn't draw into it. No worries, though. Uh, um, well, it's not going to matter. Uh, even if I wrath for what I can wrath for, it's not going to get rid of enough. Uh -oh. Like some playing tendrils or language shenanigans? Uh, Gaze of Granite. Oh, I see what you're saying. I see. So you can X equals two. And yeah. that gets the morph and the wall of losses. Yeah. And all of my stuff. Uh oh. So yeah. if I get X equals three. That's much more helpful. You hit the XR, you hit the recruiter, merchant. Animar. Uh, Animar, yeah. And Man of War, yeah. Yeah, you got me. Oh man. So the morph was the fortune thief. Gotcha. And then, yeah. Oh, and the zealous conscripts. <laughs> because why not? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I thought about throwing that whole hand away just because it was full of tap lands, and I was like, no, maybe I'll get there. Fair enough. I mean. In multiplayer, Animar is less awesome because it turns an arch enemy. Everyone has to kill you first. <laughs> um, and in Tiny Leaders, you don't get as big spells. So it's just one-on-one -on -one EDH where 
honestly, I kind of think he ought to be banned as a commander in one-on-one -on -one EDH mm -hmm. because stupid stuff like this happens. Gotcha. Uh, now, granted, I also got the Peregrine Drake both games, so yeah. um, I guess that happens too. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'll have to play again sometime. Yes, 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 yes.